In this video, I'm going to be showing you step by step on how you can connect CG dropshipping to Etsy. Now, after you connect guys CG dropshipping to Etsy, like if someone buys the product from you on Etsy, CG dropshipping will do everything for you. You don't even have to do anything. You don't have to touch the product. You don't have to do anything. I'm going to explain that to you right now. And I'm going to show you how you can connect it and also some mistakes that you should never do if you are doing this now the first thing you want to do guys you want to click on sign in or register on cg dropshipping you want to register or sign in so i already have an account i'm going to click on sign in now after that i'm just going to use my google to log into my cg dropshipping um all right now the, the first thing you want to do guys as you can see that what i like about cg is the the prices and also like a lot of people don't know that you can only sell handmade products on Etsy and a lot of people are using AliExpress and other e-commerce websites and your account gets banned. The beauty of CG is they are only going to show you like after you connect your uh, your Etsy, I'm, which I am going to tell you how you can do that. I'm going to show you how you can do that right now. Now the beauty of um, CG is when you connect your uh, Etsy to CG, like they are, they are going to stop showing you products that are not handmade for example for example this product this is not a handmade product now after you connect your store um, cg will only show you products that are handmade so that your account will not get banned okay now i used aliexpress to drop ship on uh, on etsy and my account got banned because i don't know that i can't list handmade i can't list products that are not handmade so like i said as you can see um you can find literally any product on cg now here is exactly how you can connect um yeah how you can connect cg dropshipping to your etsy first you want to click on in the top left it says here authorization i hope i pronounced this correctly now you want to select here etsy you will find a lot of e-commerce websites here including shopify ebay uh tiktok um yeah etsy as you can see wix now you want to click on etsy okay you want to select etsy and what you need to do guys now is you have to just, just click this x i'm going to explain to you how you can do this now you want to click on add store okay you want to click on add store and and after guys you click on add store um as you can see it says here you are currently uh signed in as this one and not you okay um as you can see an application would like to to connect to your account so this is my etsy account and what you need to do guys you want to scroll down okay you want to scroll down as you can see this is what what cg will do this application is trying to connect to your account you should be seeing this message because you are using an etsy app if you didn't come to this page through an etsy app you if you follow the link in email or chat close this window now as you can see this is what cg will do it will be connected to your account it will see the billing and the shipping addresses that's the beauty like they are, they are going to do that everything like they are going to do everything automatically you don't even have to send the product or like handle shit, like returns stuff like that they are going to do everything for you you just want to find winning products on on cg i'm going to, to show you how you can do that now you want to click on update it, it, like it will be it will have access to shipping addresses it will see all billing statement and data real shopping carts add or remove from shopping carts now we just want to give this access like let's click on grant access and after that guys as you can see we have successfully connected our Etsy to our CG now before you list anything before I show you how to list anything if you don't have a shop on Etsy make sure you, you open a shop on Etsy you want to click on your profile and click on sale okay now, if you don't see their sale, you want to click on this as your shop manager and you want to complete all the steps. Okay. You want to first list a random item from your house. It could be in any item so that it will let you add here the, your credit card and sit, sit up billing and your shop. Because if you don't add here random pictures, it will not let you go to, this, to the next step. Okay. Now, you just want to list a random product from your house. Make sure the product is not um it, it's not coming from a big company or anything like that make sure it's handmade 100 percent okay just like 
like um, take a picture of something you have on your house it could be like i uh, your uh, airpods keys or anything like that now after that you want to complete the setup you want to complete this now if you don't know how to open a shop you just want to search on youtube how to open a shop on Etsy, and you will find a lot of videos about this now after that guys you want to go to your cg and you can see here it says here you can list cg products to your store you want to click on list now and you want to find um after you click on list now now as you can see guys you will find the products that you will you you are like able to sell on your etsy okay now for example i'm going to list this one because it looks like it's handmade now what you need to do guys next you want to scroll down and click on list okay now every product you click on you will see this list button here click on list and as you can see i'm going to um yeah i'm going to select etsy okay i'm going to click on authorize i think it it, it it was yeah as you can see now i'm going to click on this x and i just wanted to yeah i just need to delete um to delete my ebay store from this because i have linked my ebay store here so i'm going to delete it now for you it will not have any problem you can easily list um you can easily list um your um your products to your uh, etsy now i'm going to find here my dashboard as you can see i'm going to scroll down and i have connected as you can see ebay and etsy now i need to delete um i need to delete here the, the ebay account now you just wanna yeah you just wanna you just wanna click on list now and you will find here the products if you haven't linked your ebay or any other e-commerce websites you will only find here handmade products okay now we want to click on a list okay list um after that you want to select here uh, etsy and next thing you want to add here the quantity okay you want to add here where it says quantity your price like your, your price here as you can see this is it says here your price this is how much they are going to charge you for this item this this is the price that you are going to charge okay now i like to use like 15 dollars so that the profit margin will be like 10 dollars i'm going to add all this like make sure you add 15 dollars to all these uh different variations and yeah 15 15 15 make sure you do that to all uh, variations here i'm going to do that right now Fifteen. So every time this item sells, the profit margin for me will be f uh, like ten dollars, around ten dollars, because like Etsy charges this the fee every time you list an item. Now, yeah, after you do this, guys, what you need to do, guys, next is you wanna click on where it says the shipping method, and you wanna select. Make sure you select CG Packet Liquid USA. Okay, make sure you select this one. It's fast. Okay. And where it says my orders must ship to like select United States here because a lot of people that are going to use Etsy are from from United States. Now after you select United States, you want to click on list it now. Okay. It says here, please enter your store price. So I didn't enter here the um, I, I didn't complete all this. I'm going to complete all this. Yeah, now you want to click on list now. N please fill tags okay i'm going to add here the tags um I'll like um necklace i'm just going to an example now you want to click on list now and as you can see the product title cannot be longer than 80 characters now you want to edit the product title you want to delete some um like you want to delete it and you want to uh, make it better of course you are going to change it after you list the item on your etsy etsy you can then click on edit and you can edit it but you better like add the title here 
okay if you don't know what title to add just go to it and find other competitors and copy their title and then make sure it's the same product okay it like make sure they are selling the same product that you are trying to list click on confirm and as you can see it says here please wait and this may take a few minutes so it may not be listed successfully the product listed as you can see the product has been listed to my Etsy and after you open it guys your shop you will be able um, to see the listing there okay so every time someone now buys um, buys your item like Etsy will do everything for you including shipping the the shipping the the item to the customer okay now they will do everything for you now make sure you complete this uh, information before you can see the the listing on your Etsy so I hope guys this video helped if it does leave a like subscribe let me know in the comments if this works if you need any help let me know in the comments I reply to every single comment